Okay, 2013 Ford Edge, and we're just gonna, rotors are looking pretty good. Um, all we're gonna do is change the pads. So this is a pretty simple job. Uh, if you have any, like like you're questioning your rotors, then yeah, obviously we're gonna, you, we need to change the whole thing, but we're just gonna change the pads, so really simple. Uh, you got two bolts holding the caliper in. Uh, those are 17 millimeters. And uh, let's let's hit those. All right, that's it. So take it out, and uh, we're gonna lay we're gonna lay the caliper on top of the rotor. Uh, I'm gonna go get a coat hanger, and we're gonna go ahead and secure it with the good old-fashioned coat hanger. There it is. All right, this is the official mechanic tool. It's a coat hanger, so we're gonna remove it from both sides. You just put it in through one of the holes, put the other one over there, and then just twist it around. And, and all we're doing is just getting it out of our way and securing it. Well, yeah, that's good enough. Eh, throw that one in there just for good luck. All right, that all that does is gives us room to get in here and take off the brake pads. So as you can see, our brake pads, they're actually pretty good, but uh, we've had them for a while, and so we're just gonna go ahead and replace them anyway. So uh, anyway, we're gonna take them off along with the brackets. All right, now we're gonna take off those little brackets in there. Our di ours didn't come with new brackets. Sometimes they do, so we're just gonna clean them up and uh, and uh, get them back in there with some grease. So, all right, now we're gonna shoot it with uh, just some cleaner, just to you know, just get all the dust off it. Hit the calipers now that we're already here. All right, you know, don't try not to breathe that in. I'm actually pretty far away, and there's a nice breeze going. All right, again, we just hit it with a little bit of that brake uh, cleaner. Um, we're using some AutoZone special brake cleaner. Break clean. That's not English, is it? I don't know what this is. Ah. All right. And, uh, you know, just cleaning them off. Um, again, some come with new ones, but it's okay. We can reuse the old ones. Just We're just taking everything off. Then what we're going to do is we're going to put some brake grease, right? Everywhere metal touches metal. So inside here, 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 up here, on the other side. And uh, just so... <clears throat> As this slides, you know, in and out, it's just keeping the dust off and not making any noises. A lot of brake pad left, but, you know, that was time. There you go. Okay, we put a little grease on the caliper. We're gonna put a little bit more on this ring, right? Because that's what, no, in like right there. On the side of, the side. Yeah, there you go, like that. All right, because that's what goes up and down, inside and out. All right, and then uh, now we'll do the caliper bolts. All right, so we're gonna, he's gonna try to do this with one hand or uh, by himself. So we're using a C-clamp, and all we're doing is we're pushing in, we're using an old brake pad, and then we're just gonna push in the the uh, pistons. Uh, remember to remove the cap, 
Um, you know, just so that it might push the air up a little bit. We go on this side. And we could do one, one then the other, or we can try to do both. I'd rather probably just do one or another. You could do both, but you would be putting it on that bolt there that you could possibly mess up. So I think we just... Now remember, if you're doing this and it is hard, that means there's something wrong with your caliper. Um, really, it should just be nice and easy turning and it pushes in. So we did one side. Now we're going to do the other. And then we'll come back to the other side. And, you know, it, it just needs to be not flush, but it needs to be pushed in. You see it being pushed in. Yep, it looks great. That's that's how it should look. All right, now we're going to go ahead and put the brackets on and put everything together. Oh, wait. Here we go. All right, so in case you're wondering how these little brackets go, they lay down on towards the the uh, inner part of the uh, rotor there. Um, so, all right, let's keep going. Imagine how many people end up putting sometimes one of the old ones. Yeah. Uh, especially if you're new at this. And especially <laughs> when you see what you're doing, it's a lot easier. <laughs> Yeah. That was nice. Okay. All right. There you go. Flip her out. Time to right. break. Right. That's, yeah. that's, oh, we need to grease that, that, those bolts or? Uh, first, we'll put the caliper on. Okay. And then we'll grease the bolts. All right. So when you put them on, just the rubber where the bracket is, those rubber ones just don't pinch them. You want to... You see, it's this. Yeah, there you go. That one's good. Okay, and yeah, that one's a little. Yeah. You want to get those right so the bolt goes in. Top one first. All right. So now that is the one at the bottom, right? Because the the thicker one is the one at the top. Yeah, this is the bottom one. That's the bottom one. So all we do is dip it one time. And whatever comes out, that's all That's all you need. So then we'll go ahead and put it in the bottom. Right, and then, and then wipe off the excess. Uh, and then we'll bolt those down to 65 foot-pounds. So we'll torque that in a little bit. And then they got to catch. You got what? They no, the bolts got to catch. Once they catch, then they'll start tightening down. And oh, they got tight really quick. So hold on one second. All right, we're looking for 65 foot-pounds. We got digital and analog going. A little bit, I didn't, a little more. There you yeah. go, that's, that's 65. Now, same way on the top. That was good? Uh-huh. All right. So that's how to change the brake pads out. Um, I hope this video uh, encourages you to change out your brake pads because it's pretty simple. It doesn't get much easier than that. 
Uh, if you like the video, uh, give me a thumbs up. Please like and subscribe. Every little bit helps. Have a great rest of your day.